Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here with Fred and Zhang Zhang and we're going to demonstrate all the obedience commands he's learned here at school. We're going to start out first by introducing the training equipment. Fred's got a standard six foot webbed training leash and it keeps the bulk of that leash in his right hand which leaves his left hand free to make a correction which is a simple tug and release on the training collar. And that's the second piece of equipment. Now we'll show you how to properly put that on and use it effectively when Zhang Zhang comes home. And we're going to start off with healing, which is properly walking on the leash, and the command is Zhang Zhang heal. Now he should stay right on your left hand side, and we don't want him pulling or lagging behind. And I know that healing was a problem for you, and you can see how very nicely he's doing it. He's doing it very, very nicely here in a controlled setting, and he does it great outside with distractions and traffic. So we're really happy with his progress. Now, as you notice, whenever Fred stops moving his feet, whenever he stops, Zhang Zhang's been trained to automatically sit. So this is nice when you're in the city, and just like that, when you're in the city to stop, to cross the street or something, he's been trained to sit and wait for the next command. Now, the next command we're going to show you is a stay command. It's a hand and a voice command. Fred uses the flat of his left hand and the one word firm command to stay. So oh, he sits very nicely, and these sit stays, keep them relatively short in the beginning, about one minute, and work your way up to three minutes as you guys get better working together. Now Fred's going to walk back to Zhang Zhang, he walks around to his left hand side, gets back to his right, Zhang Zhang's right that is, so that way he's back at heel position, and Fred starts off with healing again. There's a nice automatic sit. Like I said, whenever you stop walking, he should sit automatically, just like that. Fred puts him into another stay, again using the flat of his left hand and just the one word firm command to stay. We don't want to use his name when you give him the stay command. The only time you want to use his name is when you're calling him or when you're healing with him. That's it. This is our recall or the come command. So when he comes back to you, just like with the automatic sit, he comes back and he should sit and then wait for another command. So Fred puts him into another sit stay. He's done really, really good with the obedience training, with the healing, and his housebreaking has been impeccable. What we're going to do for you guys is give you a sample schedule. Or that way you can follow that at home to the best of your ability, and I think it's going to really help you with his housebreaking. And you notice with he's staying right even with Fred's left hand side. He's not lagging behind, he's not forging ahead. And this will make it a pleasure to be able to walk him in the city. Another nice automatic sit. Now the next command we're going to demonstrate for you is our down command. Again, it's a hand and a voice command. Fred uses the flat of his left hand towards the ground and the one word firm command to down and then he gave him the stay command afterwards. Now your down stays last a little bit longer than your sit stays. Start off at about three minutes and work your way up to five. One of the important things is too is that you practice these obedience skills inside your apartment or your home. You don't need a lot of space. And it'll help with his house manners. Well, as Fred returns back to him, again, he walks around him for an added distraction, gets him back to heel position, and then has Zhang Zhang heal from there. See, Fred uses the flat of his left hand there and the one word command to just down. Nice automatic sit. Fred has him back to heel position. Now the final command we're going to demonstrate for you is going to be our down from a distance. We've shown you heel, sit, down, stay and come, and this is our distance down. This is the only, this is the only command that Zhang Zhang's given us a little bit of a problem with, and this is generally our hardest command to teach. But start off close, put them into a sit-stay close, and slowly work your way out. 
No, he didn't do it right away. Fred said no. Very nice. Now, if you didn't hear him, when he didn't do the down command, Fred said no. Gave him a little tug and told him, to get, told him the down command again. Now, we've shown you the heel, sit, down, stay, and the come command. We're going to show you all this information live and in person when he comes home. We want to thank you so much for using Nora's Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer. We look forward to seeing you very soon.